Myers. We got to talk about the Carolina Panthers, man. That's a team we used to talk about all the time in the offseason. Obviously, you know, some other storylines came and went after they acquired Baker Mayfield. But now that training camp's underway, preseason games right around the corner, there's a lot of exciting news, you know, involving the Carolina Panthers, specifically in that quarterback situation. I know you have the details there. But before we get into that, Panthers fans, look. It's an exciting time to be alive, right? If you're a Panthers fan, this is the best the roster has looked in a number of years. You got a lot better at quarterback, potentially. You got a young quarterback, potentially, in Matt Corral. A lot of buzz around this organization. What game are you going to this season to check out all this exciting you know, football that's going to be coming into Charlotte? Are you going to a Charlotte game? Are you going to a road game? Let us know in the comment section below what game you're going to go see. But, uh, Mize, what's the latest out of Carolina? Yeah, Nick, and you know if you're lucky, we might see you there. We're planning on going to a Panthers game or two this season, so that that's pretty great exciting. stadium. Great stadium. So, uh, but I want to talk about you know Ben McAdoo's thoughts on Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield has been here for a short time uh, in Carolina, but he's really started to impress. You know, there's not much to fight over. Obviously, Matt Cross probably going to take a season or two off and uh, develop. Sam Darnold, you know what you have in him, and that's nothing to write home about. But McAdoo's thoughts on Baker Mayfield, uh, they've they've been good because early on in Mayfield's career, McAdoo was almost his biggest critic and he kind of talked about his size, being undersized. You know, he didn't see a lot of pro style offense in his college tape. Didn't think that, you know, he said, your personality can't win games. But, you know, going on to now, McAdoo uh, likes what he sees out of Baker. You know, he's his offensive coordinator, but he didn't have to say these things, so I'm going to think it's genuine. Uh, He says the thing for Baker is he's been a lot of different offensive systems going back through college and now coming into the pros. Uh, He's bright, and he really works hard, and that is going to help him. He's here very early in the mornings, and he's burning the midnight oil to get caught up. So he's very impressed with Baker's work ethic going through the, all of the plays so far. And then he goes on to say, one of his strengths is his command. He can lead a room, he can command a room, and he can command an offense. He has a good presence about him, and you know he has a fire in his gut. So very high praise of McAdoo on, uh, you know, Baker's competitive spirit, his leadership ability, and his hard work learning the playbook. And I think that's why we've seen him shine early on uh, in his stay here in Carolina, don't you think? Well, and it's not just been McAdoo either. Matt Rule, according to New York Post, uh, has been very impressed by uh, Baker Mayfield as well. Uh, This is what Rule said. What he's done in 10 days of camp is pretty impressive. He's making really big jumps. Right. And that's is obviously when you're compared against, you know, Sam Darnold, you got to take it, you know, with the with a frame of, you know, some context there because it is Sam Darnold. But let's be honest here. Baker Mayfield, this is a whole new offense, whole new players. Baker Mayfield spent his whole career, obviously, you know, in Cleveland, you know, with that good offensive line that they had there, the players he knew how to play with, the running game and all that. And it's obviously, you know, a different move when you go to a new team, new organization. There's going to be a lot of moving parts, just just getting the flow, new offense, all that kind of stuff. And the fact that Baker Mayfield is making such headway with Matt Rule and Ben McAdoo right out the gate is pretty impressive. I do think one thing's interesting. So the Panthers really came, uh, recently came out with their, you know, uh, unofficial depth chart at this point in the preseason. They had Sam Darnold and Baker Mayfield as code number one quarterbacks. Now, if I'm a Panthers fan, don't freak out. Baker Mayfield's your guy. You don't have to worry about that at all. But I think what the Panthers are doing here is pretty smart. They're kind of doing twofold. One, they want to let Baker know, hey, you're doing great, but don't think we're handing you the job. Keep going, keep growing, keep developing, keep getting more familiar with the offense and outright continue to win the job and be our clear-cut number one guy going to the season. And number two, you don't want to just dump Sam Darnold immediately because then obviously the Panthers want to potentially trade Darnold to get recoup something for him. Obviously, they're not going to get their full investment back, but they want to get something back. You don't get it by like dumping Darnold on the depth chart and just broadcasting the world that you think he stinks, even though most people think Sam Darnold stinks at this point. So by keeping that code number one thing, they kind of keep the door open for a potential trade, you know, whether it's just, a, you know, getting some sort of draft pick, maybe a, maybe even just a rotational player at some other position. I think that's really smart by the Panthers and a good move by this coaching staff. But, but all in all, if I'm a Panthers fan, this is probably the best I felt about this quarterback situation since a healthy Cam Newton was here. And, I, and, I'm, and, I'm, and if, I'm a, if I'm a Panthers fan, I'm really excited right now. Yeah, no, it's, a, it's an exciting time to be a Carolina Panthers fan. Uh, Baker Mayfield, let's... Uh, right off last season obviously he's playing hurt through a lot of last season uh it wasn't his best performance so to speak but he's had a lot of great uh runs with cleveland obviously they're a very talented team 
but this is a very upgraded i'd say i think we've agreed on this is probably the most improved oh, offense and defense roster wise in this division uh, yeah. obviously heavily upgraded offensive line Iki Aquano looks great um you got some good receiving weapons robbie anderson dj moore uh, uh, Christian McCaffrey back healthy. That's a huge upgrade uh, over last year. Um, JC Horn at corner. He huge, looked great huge. last year. Uh, there's a lot to be uh, excited about as a Carolina Panther and having Baker Mayfield roll in here uh, healthy, you know, ready to go. He's got it. it. You think that Baker Mayfield ever had a chip on his shoulder? You oh, wait yeah. to see him this year. This chip is like the world's largest Dorito. It's the largest chip you've ever seen in your entire life. Okay, Baker Mayfield is coming in with a purpose, and uh, if and when they ever play the Browns, which I, I think they do play this yep. year, it's going to be like uh, the once great Carolina Panther Steve Smith said, bring your goggles, it's going to be a bloodbath, referring to when Steve Smith was on the Ravens and he came to Carolina to play the Panthers. So uh, Baker Mayfield is going to come looking for blood when they play the Browns. So uh, week, I, week one, by the way, week one is that is that game. So yeah, yeah. at home in Charlotte, that's going to be that's going to be a fun one. I would suggest going to that game if yeah. you could. But uh, nonetheless, I think this is an exciting time to be a Carolina Panthers fan. All right, Nick, it's time to get your internet privacy back today on every device you own in any country you want. Don't let anyone but you control your internet. NordVPN keeps you safe from prying eyes wherever you go online with their military-grade encryption. Is your favorite Netflix or streaming content blocked in the U.S.? You can simply connect to one of the many countries available with NordVPN and get the access you need. That's right, Maya. So right now, get our exclusive NordVPN deal here at nordvpn.com slash SMI. It's risk-free, risk-free now with Nord, NordVPN's 30-day money-back guarantee. Again, get that exclusive deal, nordvpn.com slash SMI. 